Once again, hello everyone. After getting a request from one of my subscribers, today I am going to do the quiz called Easy Math Saga Quiz or let's say Math Saga Quiz from quizfacts.com. So now let's start this quiz. This question number 6 has got 4 different version or type so you need to watch the image carefully and you need to see the each number in the image with proper attention and care. For example in version 1 of this question just see the numbers written in the image it is written 2 5 11 23 47 95 and question mark then the correct answer will be 191 so just type 199 for this question. Now in version 2 of this question, it is written here 3, 4, 6, 10, 18, 34 question mark in the image. Then the correct answer for this question will be 66. So you need to type 66 for this question. Now in version 3 of this question, it is written here 1, 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, 13 or let's say question mark. Then the correct answer will be 13. So you need to type 13 for this sort of image in question number 6. Now in version 4 of this question, it is written here 2, 3, 5, 9, 17, 33 question mark in the image. Then the correct answer will be 65. So you need to click or let's say you need to type 65 in the option or let's say you have to Now question number 9 is a little bit confusing one as it has got 5 different variants or version so you need to watch each and every detail of the image very carefully and you need to type the answer that I have written in the answer box. For instance in version 1 of this question if you find this sort of image okay this sort of same to shape image then the correct answer for this question will be 38. So you need to type 38 in the option if you find this sort of image. Now in version 2 of this question, you will find this sort of image. And if you find this sort of image, then the correct answer for this question will be 3939. So you need to type 39 in the answer box if you find the same to same image. Now in version 3 of this question, you will find this sort of image. And if you find this sort of image, then the correct answer will be 40. After each version, one more cube of blocks is added, okay? Now in version 4 of this uh, question, you will find this sort of image. And if you find this sort of image, then the correct answer will be 41. So you need to type 41 if you find this sort of same to same image in the uh, question number 9. Now in version 5 of this question, you will find this sort of image and if you find this sort of image then the correct answer will be 4242 so just type 42 in the answer box if you find this sort of image in question number 9 
Now this question number 13 has got 7 different variants or version. So first you need to read the question, especially the second last sentence of the question and after that you need to watch the image and just type the answer that I have written in answer box. For example in version 1, just read the second last sentence of the question. It is written here. Can you tell which value half a liar stands for? And after that you need to watch the image and if you find this setup same to same image then the correct answer will be 9. Now in version 2 of this question, the image is similar to version 1 but the question is different. Just read the second last sentence. It is asked here, can you tell which number the liar stands for? Then the correct answer will be 18. Previously it was asked half the value. Now it is not asked that. That's why the correct answer is 18. Now in version 3 of this question, just read the question. It is asked here, can you tell which value half a liar stands for? And just see the image. And if you find this sort of same to same question and same image then the correct answer will be 2.5. Now in version 4 of this question, the image is similar to version 3 but the question is different. It is asked here, can you tell which number the liar stands for? So the correct answer for this sort of question and image will be 5. Now in version 5 of this question, just uh, read the question, it is asked here, can you tell which value half a liar stands for and just watch the image. And if you find this are same to same question and same to same image then the correct answer will be 1. So you need to type 1 in the option. Now in version 6 of this question, the image is similar to version 5 but the question is different. It is asked here, can you tell which number the liar stands for, then the correct answer will be 2. So you need to type 2 in the answer box. Now the last portion that means portion 7 just watch the image and just watch the question or let's say just read the question then if you find the same two same thing that I have shown here then the correct answer will be 3 so you need to type 3 in the answer box. Now question number 14 has got 5 different portion or type so you need to watch the image very carefully and just type the answer that I have written in the answer box of mine. For example, in version 1 of this question, you need to watch the image. And in the image, there is written some number. That means 2 bracket 7 plus 2 multiplied 3 bracket closed plus 1 divided by 1 the divided 3. Then the correct answer for this question will be 81. So you need to type 81 in the answer box. Now in version 2 of this question, this image is different from that of version 1. It is written here 2 open bracket 7 plus 2 multiply 3 bracket close plus 2 divided by 1 divided by 4. Then the correct answer will be 112 that means 112. Now in version 3 of this question, this is also different image. It is written here 2 open bracket 7 plus 2 multiply 3 bracket close plus 4 divided by 1 by 5. Then the correct answer will be 150 that means 150. Now in version 4 of this question, it is written here 2 bracket 7 plus 2 multiply 3 bracket close plus 4 divided by 1 by 6. Then the correct answer for this question will be 180. So you need to type 180 in the option. Now version 5, I mean that means the last version, it is written here 2 bracket 7 plus 2 multiply 3 minus 2 divided by 1 by 8 then the correct answer for this question would be 192 so just type 192 now the last question that means question number 15 has got five different version or type so you need to read the question only and just click the option that I have shown here do not try to watch the image as image is similar but only the question is different for example in version 1 of this question just read the question. It is asked here. This is 3 more than 4 times the number of hyacinth. How many daffodils are in my garden? Then the correct answer will be D is equals to H4 plus 3 image. Now in version 2 of this question, it is written here. This is 3 times the number of hyacinth. If I plucked half of the daffodils, how many will be left? Then the correct answer will be 1 by 2 d is equals to 3 s by 2 in the option. So just click this option. 
Now in version 3 of this question, it is asked here, this is 8 more than 12 times the number of hyacinth. How many hyacinth are in the garden? Then you need to click the image which, in which it is written as equals to d minus 8 by 12. Now in version 4, it is asked, this is 6 more than 10 times the number of hyacinth. How many hyacinth are in my garden? Then you need to click the image in which it is written as equals to d minus 6 by 10. Now in version 5 of this question, it is asked here, this is 3 more than 4 times the number of hyacinth. How many hyacinth are in my garden? Then you need to click the option in which it is written as equals to d minus 3 by 4. You can see here I have scored 100% and I hope you have also scored 100%. So thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe, comment and please share this video.